Now we are going to start with the images of the convex lens. So we will be taking different cases. So in the first case we will be taking that the object is between O and F. So let us draw the figure. This is the lens. This is the optical center. Right. So object is between O and F. So let us take this and let us say this is the object. So what happened? Uh, here we will be considering any two rules. So I am taking those rules. The one is the, the, uh, the ray coming parallel to principal axis after refraction passes through focus. And the another rule I am taking is the ray that passes through O goes straight. So we will see that uh, when this kind of thing occur, so they, uh, they are not meeting but when they, we produce them behind the mirror, we see that they meet actually and this is the image formed. Right. So we see that the image formed is virtual, erect, front of the lens and magnified. This is how you are going to draw the figure. Again, I again I am explaining parallel ray after refraction passes through focus, another coming from optical center goes straight, when you will try to meet them, they will meet behind it and it is magnified because you, uh, it has been imaginary uh, meeting, so it is virtual and we know virtual image is always erect. The second image is when object is at F, so we have again convex lens object is at F, let us say this is at this point. So we see that when it is uh, present at F, then again we will be taking two cases. So the first case is again I am taking the same one, a ray coming parallel after refraction passes through focus, another going from optical center passes straight. So this is the ray and we will see that these parallel rays are going to meet at infinity. So we say that the image form is at infinity actually they will meet at infinity. So we will say that it is a real image and we know that real image is inverted and it will be highly magnified. The image which is formed far from the lens is always magnified. So this is what is the object is at image for the object is at F. Third case we will be taking it object between F and 2F. So this is the lens, this is the principal axis, optical center, let us say this is F, twice of this distance let us approximately take it as 2F and we know that uh, the object is between F and 2F. So we will see that a ray coming parallel to principal axis after refraction, the same rules I am following, it passes through focus. So this is focus. Another is that a ray which is uh, coming from optical center, again it passes straight and we see that they actually meet at this point and if we take the twice of this distance it comes out to be 2F, it is back of the 2F, it is beyond the 2F. So we see that image is formed beyond 2F, it is magnified and actually it is meeting so it is real and inverted. So this is the characteristics for the image form. See try to draw first uh, with rough hand and then try to use the rulers with the exact measurement then they will be exactly meeting at the same point. So next we have is object at 2F, now the object is at 2F. So we have like this, this is the optical center F twice of this distance let us say it is 2F. On this side also let us say this is F and twice of it is 2F. So we will see that uh, here the object is at 2F. So let us say it is at 2F. So again we will be taking the both uh, those two cases, a ray coming parallel after refraction passes through focus. Second one, a ray coming from optical center passes straight and we see that it exactly meet at 2F. So we say that image is formed at 2F, actually meeting, so real inverted and the important thing that it is of same size. It is not magnified, it is not diminished, it is of same size. Next is object beyond 2F, so 
now object is beyond 2f you need to keep same distance this side same distance this side same this side and same this side so object is beyond 2f again we will be considering on two, uh, the same two rules array coming parallel after refraction passes through focus array coming from O passes straight we see that it meets between f and 2f so image is formed between f and 2f real inverted actually meeting and but diminished smaller than the object right the next case is when the object is at infinity object is at infinity here you need to draw the figure for the nature one which we discussed so this is o this is f this is 2f so the rays are coming from infinity so it will just meet them and we know that the point where they meet is f so because it is a converging lens so that means image is formed at f real inverted and highly diminished and highly diminished very small a point like so these are the ray diagrams for the images of the convex lens just try them out it's uh, the better way or the easiest way to learn them is just first uh, learn the tabular form that when the object is the object is at certain place image is formed at this place and the nature is this and then try to use those uh, tabular form which you have learned and then try to draw the figures then your fingers won't be wrong just practice it out it's very simple very very simple it's, it's one of my uh, the favorite chapter of the physics right so just try it out